up, everyone? This is LR Games, and today I'm watching episode 10 of Infinite Dendogram. Uh, hmm. There we go. <laughs> uh, last episode, uh, well, the, uh, the bad guy attacked the city, and everyone has to work together to defend against the traitors. All these characters we barely know are fighting for their kingdom, I guess. And the main character is really motivated for some reason. He killed a guy last episode. So, yay. Uh, the one that did the most, I guess, was that lady that occasionally comes up. Um, reporter. She's apparently someone much more powerful than we anticipated. Oh no, what a surprise. Um, well, I guess I just have to get rid of all the monsters and other things. She, uh, she saved the princess, but then he took her back with a spell. So now we're at square one again, so... She'll need to rescue her again. Well, let's start this episode. So I guess we're getting a backstory for this random guy that they're, she's going to defeat with the Energizer Bunny. That he came in his work clothes. Oh, we've seen those before. So she saved him early on, the main character. Well, I wouldn't even really call him a main character at this point. Everyone has had pretty much. Equal screen time. Considering I know almost nothing about her, I'm not entirely invested in this fight. Uh, <laughs> we got more on this random bad guy than we have on her. He just needs to replace the batteries. Oh. No, he needs to charge him. I guess they're rechargeable ones. At least we're getting something now. Mm 
Oh, she's playing her character. That I'd get addicted to a VR game. That reminds me, Half-Life Alex is coming out very soon, and I'm pretty excited. That's a random thought. Oh, I forgot I had that in the corner. Let me just download this game real quick. Well, that probably helped. Also, you've spent all this time just playing and getting powerful, but you haven't really done any progress. <laughs> I think that's called echolocation. Hey guys, get a dodging. You know, sound isn't that slow. A twin-tailed bullet, the most powerful of bullets. These guys are very dedicated to their role-playing. Gotta give them a little respect. That almost, that almost sounded like Alka Seltzer. <laughs> oh! Wow! She actually made a twin tailed girl appear. That's nice. I do like her design. Did you really have to say that in English?
Did those ears even really do anything? They didn't last long either. Why was it, you know, a decision between ears and insta-death poison? Did you really have to walk out the front door? Yeah, that was a bit of an odd zoom there. Very low quality. I guess that only hurts bad guys. Really need that many people to attack him? It's gonna be a bit messy. Like, what would they do once they all got to him? Just take turns? Are we getting the backstory of this, like, random new girl? We are, for some reason. Hmm. <sighs> You know, considering it's overwhelming enough with all these characters in the anime, I'm sure it's much more difficult in the, in the novel where you have to remember the names. Does the game come with the headset?
Wait, what? Wait, what? I thought it... Um... Okay, I didn't expect that. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. That was okay. Show me a blonde night lady and then give me the backstory of a blonde only to turn this around, huh? Okay, that was pretty clever. I'll give it that. Well, I say friend is a bit much. I've only talked like three times. It's really cringy how they always say those things in English. Yeah, well, he's more of a hentai main character, I think. Good line. They never would have expected you to be yourself.
immune to holy damage or something? Wait. Has she shown up before? I don't remember her. There are way too many characters in this series. Oh, that's, okay, that's a, that's a line to end on, I guess. Well, I mean, <laughs> that was surprised in an amusing way this time, this episode with the, uh, <laughs> I did not expect that character, character to basically be a reverse trap, that, <laughs> That was weird. Uh, hmm. I mean, it was more interesting and, uh, uh, Log Horizon with, uh, Akatsuki. You know, being a girl and being spawned as her, or, or appearing in that other world as her avatar, which was a male. But thankfully, she was able to change into what she actually looks like. Uh, but <laughs> I really didn't expect that here. I'm still, you know, I still don't really know why she's, or he, I'll just call him he, because that's what the avatar is like, why he is on that side. Because we got the backstory, but it doesn't really fit very well into what he's doing. And to be honest, I'm not all too interested to find out. But there are two more episodes left, probably, so we got those two to explain some more things, I guess. Or add more characters and events and distractions. Um. I just want to see the main character get stronger over time. That would have been nice. An adventure. But no. Just a whole bunch of characters getting in the way. And no real fun interactions either. It's just mostly like business, business, business. Politics, politics. Mysterious, mysterious. All right, well, that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.